Live from Manitoba Egg Days in Brandon, I'm Dusty Vandersteen. Behind me is a big tractor with a cool story. I had a chance to catch up with Adam Reed to talk about Big Roy. Well, Big Roy is actually the result of the horsepower wars of the 1970s and all the tractor manufacturers were trying to figure out how to get more power to the farmer. And Roy Robinson, who was one of the founders of Versatile, had this idea for a articulated tractor with the engine in the back and four inline wheels. And as a result, they built the Versatile 1080, which is more commonly known now as Big Roy. So they built a lot of the components in Winnipeg and shipped them down to Fargo for final assembly. They got the tractor put together and rumor has it it cost a million dollars back in 1977. They got it in the field and realized that it didn't work. It doesn't turn very well, it's really heavy, and of course it was really expensive. So there was a second set of parts to build a second Big Roy that was turned around in Fargo, sent back to Winnipeg and cut up. So since then, Big Roy has been at the Manitoba Egg Museum since uh, probably the 80s and last year was the 50th anniversary of versatile four-wheel drive production so we brought it back to Winnipeg. It was supposed to be just a paint job change and it turned out being a complete frame off restoration. Big Roy has been at the Manitoba Egg Museum for the last probably 25-30 years and it's one of their key attractions. Of course they have the uh, Thresherman's reunion every year but people come from all over the world to see Big Roy and it's funny when I'm traveling in Europe or overseas and I talk about versatile and I talk about the four-wheel drives people have kind of a vague idea and if I show them a picture of Big Roy they instantly recognize it and go oh that's Big Roy that's versatile and, and they, they make that connection so it's really it's it's world famous it's it's known everywhere and when people think about the glory days of versatile in the 70s Big Roy is often one of the things that comes to their mind and after this uh, when we finish this uh, this 50th anniversary celebration and of course it's the 40th year for Manitoba Egg Days too and Big Roy's 40th birthday it'll go back to the Manitoba Egg Museum where it will be on permanent display. Big Roy's nickname is a result of the founder of Versatile, or one of the two founders of Versatile, Roy Robinson. And he was a larger-than-life guy. He was well over six feet tall, always had a big Stetson hat on. And this was really his kind of brainchild, and it was done at the Skunk Works of Versatile, and, you know, using, like, the what if we did this, and what if we did that, and essentially Big Roy is what they came up with. And I'm not sure that he ever had intended for it to be nicknamed Big Roy, but, of course, it being his name, being that he was larger-than-life, the Versatile, 1080 became Big Roy. Come check out Big Roy at the Westoba Credit Union showroom at the Keystone Center in Brandon. Live from Manitoba Egg Days, I'm Dusty Vandersteen.